Because we're looking to stop a string of burglaries days before Dr. Kevin Rogers was killed in his Northwest Side home. The prime suspect, Karan Bickham Hurst, and a teen are behind bars. Court documents reveal that Hurst may have been involved in burglaries, including one before the death of the doctor. Tonight, we dig into these court documents, all 16 pages, to show you how surveillance cameras played a key role in helping police crack the case. At 9.28 in the morning, a surveillance camera here at Eagle Creek Elementary School puts the suspect's vehicle in the area of another burglary not far from Dr. Rogers' home. That's nearly 30 minutes before that deadly encounter. At 9.55, surveillance video from here, Pike Township Fire Station 65, shows the suspect's vehicle heading towards the doctor's neighborhood. At 10.01, a residential camera on Ballinshire South Drive shows the 2002 Chevy Impala registered to Karan Bickham Hurst in the neighborhood. At 10.07, based on the noise inside his home, Dr. Rogers calls his wife to ask if the guys are working on the gutters on their home. They were not scheduled that day. At 10.09, a neighbor calls 911, reports seeing four guys near the Rogers home also sees them running through the neighborhood before jumping into what he calls a suspicious vehicle. Here at the Eagle Creek Animal Clinic, notice video cameras at work. So five minutes later, at 1014, one of the cameras here spots that suspect vehicle heading towards a gas station where a Metro Police detective would spot the four men inside on North High School Road. The detective was already investigating whether they had any connections to the previous burglaries in the area. At about 11.59, detectives became aware of the shooting death of Dr. Rogers, and based on the previous burglaries, they believed that their suspects could be connected to the 2002 Chevy Impala caught on camera in this neighborhood and other locations. Beckham Hurst makes his first court appearance on Monday at 8.30. Investigators recovered stolen Cathedral High School championship rings, as well as the recovery of DNA from that jewelry and from the front door of Dr. Rogers' home. The name of the other suspect has not been released since he is a minor.